Did you learn Kabbalah all the way to know where Hashem is and where you are? Do you understand the system of creation in all the worlds, in all the layers, in all the depth of it, to understand really if He can really help you even though that He is the greatest one of them all? Just for you to understand there are certain things that the Creator cannot do. He cannot destroy the world. He cannot. Because He made a promise and He gave His word that the world will achieve its completion and the redemption will come so He cannot destroy it in one day. First thing, can He create a stone that will be too heavy for Him to lift? He can create whatever He wants. Let's see Him create something that He cannot carry. He cannot. There are certain things that the Creator cannot do. Since that moment that He sent us, and actually He sent Himself because there was nothing else except of His own greatness and being. There was the one unity and nothing except for that. And He sent Himself into physicality and dressed His own being in shapes and in covers and in, in physicality. Since that moment and on, He's in that loop with us. He's stuck in that creation with us. And He's waiting for the redemption exactly like we are. And maybe he's even in a worse place than us because it's written, Bechol tsaratam lo tsar. You feel your own pain and maybe you care about a larger range of people, a bigger amount, number of people, and you care about them and you feel their sorrow and their pain. But the Creator, He's eternal, means that He's with everyone, with all the animals. You're not being burnt with every um, animal in Australia. Right? You're not over there hearing the pain and experiencing the fear and the terror of every creation in every moment, in every point of the universe, in all times. Since the moment of creation. But He does. And you don't. You're suffering for 70 years, for 30 years, and your mind is exploding. Do you know what goes on in that pure heart of the Creator since the moment of creation? So you can kick it and say, come on, but you did it, so let's put an end to it. You don't see the big picture yet. There is something way greater that is waiting to be redeemed. Something wider than the range that your eyes can catch. Something bigger. And we must understand that we're still small. And for that we cannot see the whole picture.